Hello, this is Jaden with the Adventure Pilot here with another quick tip about setting timers in iFly IFB. To set a timer, we'll go to Menu, Setup, Timers, and we'll click Add Timer. Now we get a bunch of presets, or we can create a custom name, but for me, I'll just use Switch Tanks. And now we can set how long the timer would last, and so for the sake of this example, I'll just use 20 seconds and click Next. Now, because we don't have a timer instrument in our instrument group, it'll give us this prompt, and we'll click Add Instrument, and proceed. Now we can, excuse me, now we can drag our timer, and change the size. I'll just use it like that, and we'll click Save. Save Current. Now we have our timer here, we can see these settings. The most important to note for this example is Auto Starts on Takeoff and Pause on Ground. So now once I click the green arrow, our timer is set. We can see it says G and that means on it's on the ground. So we'll switch and start on once we get in the air. So I'll click close and you can see our timer here. And now to simulate movement so we can get in the air, I'll go to menu, start simulation mode, show simulation controls, and yes. Now I'll give us some knots and some climb. And you'll see our timer will start here in a second once it realizes that we're flying. Okay, now it realizes we're flying, and you can ignore the airspace alerts and terrain alerts. And so once our timer reaches zero, we'll actually get a pop up at the bottom here in a second. So now we have our pop-up for switch tanks. Once I click acknowledge, our timer will reset. And so now we'll know to switch our tanks in another couple of minutes. I hope you found this quick tip useful and have a wonderful time flying. Bye now.